the real princess from 50 famous fairy tales. Once upon a time, there was a prince who wished to marry a princess, but she had to be a real princess. He traveled up and down the whole world trying to find one. He had met plenty of princesses, but he could never satisfy himself that any one of them was a real princess. Finally, the prince returned home, sad at heart, for he had wished to marry a very real princess. One night, a terrific storm came up, thunder rolled and lightning flashed, and the rain poured down in torrents. At the height of the storm, there was knocking at the gate of the castle, and the old king went to open it. A maiden stood outside the gate, and what a state she was in. Water ran from her hair and her clothes, and it dripped in at the heels of her shoes and dribbled out of her toes, but she said that she was a real princess. Well, we shall see about that, thought the old queen as she went off to prepare the bedroom. Taking all the things off the bed, she laid a small pea in the slats and upon which 20 mattresses and 20 eiderdown quilts. When all was ready, she called the princess who was to sleep there that night. In the morning, the queen asked princess, asked the princess how she had rested. Oh, wretchedly, she answered. Simply abominably. I scarcely closed my eyes the whole night. Heaven knows what might have been in that bed. But as I lay upon something so hard, it was my whole body is just black and blue. It was really dreadful. Since she had left, had felt the pee through the 20 mattresses and the 20 eiderdown quilts, it was evidence that she was a real princess. For no one but a real princess could have such a fine sense of feeling. So the prince married her because he knew now that she'd, he'd found a real princess, and the pea was placed in the Royal Museum, where it can still be seen if no one has taken it away.